Yep. So now we're recording. I am drilling this plate. We're drilling the plate. And looking at the plates we put on the top of the wall here. And that will uh, show us how we finish the wall top. It's all laid out. We had the door on here, then we took it off. And now we're gonna drill holes in all of it after we marked it in position. And then we'll put it uh, back up there and put anchors through the, after we drill it through the concrete, we have to lift the plates. Then we can put the door back on, which is sitting there drying. We painted all the surfaces and put gaskets on. So then we'll uh, stick the door back up here and anchor it in place. All right, we got the thing in. It had a couple of the bolts not line up quite right. Put in these uh, one and seven eighths red, yeah, anchors by three eighths. Drilled like a half inch hole to hope make it easier to get through. Get the thing in, and then uh, the bottom still has to get two screws put in, and they use Tapcon screws. Very drilled holes in the plate. The hard part was getting the plate and the hole in the concrete to all line up. This one here was already an anchor right in the right spot, so we used that. And these were a little higher because of the thickness of the plate and the foam padding and all that. So all we have to do now is actually put screws in the top up there. There's a little flange. You can't see very well. It's dark out now. And these springs things come out pretty easily when the door is all the way open. All you do is slip them out of their little clips. When they're closed, they're under tension. They just go up against the hinge here. And when the door closes, it puts twisting on the shaft. Uh, and that's about it. So then the next step on this project will be putting the uh, paint on the inside and caulking the outside and putting in a few final fasteners that we couldn't get in. We have to get some tap cons in down there and a couple of sheet metal screws in the back up here. But everything fits pretty good now. Took a little bit of trouble getting the steel plates all lined up. 